I'm Rochelle and I'm here at 12 Division today to talk to one of the emerging artists from the Vibe Arts program. This is... Uh, my name is Moises Frank. And you're going to tell me a little bit about this program that you're a part of. Yeah, so uh, Vibe Arts is a community-based arts organization that uh, goes into community centers and uh, different uh, schools and apartment buildings and we create programs for, for youth and uh, young adults to get, get engaged with the arts. So as a street artist, being in a police station, how how did that affect your thinking about this? Like, did you change mm -hmm. your mind about being in a police station or were you against it in the beginning? Yeah, yeah, I mean, it was definitely an eye-opening situation. Uh, I came in and I felt the vibe, if you will, of, of the place and, and the people here, and it was it was really eye-opening. They have these really awesome uh, photo albums, actually, of a lot of the stuff they do for the community. And just learned a lot about them. They put on barbecues for the community uh, annually. They do programs like photography program with uh, some of the kids in the community, uh, as well as they're really they're really about youth uh, restorative justice, which is something that I, I really agree with. And, and just seeing that we're on the kind of the same wavelength was was really eye opening. Uh, yeah, maybe I've just been closed minded, but I think coming into this space really really changed things. We, uh, recently, we've uh, entered into a partnership with. Uh, Five Arts and Five Arts is a a uh, local non for profit that uh, helps get uh, budding artists jobs. And uh, one of the things that they do is they they put these artists out into to, uh, pop up art studios and get them working on uh, local issues in the community. So uh, in this partnership that we've entered into, uh, we've we've allowed our community room here that we're in now to become the pop-up art studio. We thought it was important to allow them into our building to uh, capture reality. Uh, you know, if we can develop a better art, a better relationship with uh, you know, local artists, uh, you know, it's really about showing, uh, showing them what's the tr showing them the truth, showing them about what's real in a police building, about what policing is really all about. One of the first things that uh, we know they were surprised about it was that we had this community room where we've had, uh, you know, a, where we depict a lot of our community activities. The, bo the books behind me, we actually have three of these large books, where every single community event that we go to, we show them, we, we have pictures of police officers working with the community. I, Mo Moises has been here uh, every week for the last uh, few weeks, and he's captured some interesting things, and he's created some interesting art that really sort of looks at the soul of policing. And uh, I've seen a couple of paintings that have really highlighted the police community relationship. I would like to thank Vibe Arts and Moises for coming in here and uh, and and doing what they're doing. You know, it's brought a few community members in to uh, see that the police are are working in a way that they probably would not expect, and I think it's very positive for us.